Welcome to the Old Timer Centre. We're going to be talking about this 2005 Mercedes-Benz ML500. It's got the 5 litre V8 and it's also got the 7 speed gearbox. So it's got the very reliable 5 speed engine, yet being a 7 speed you certainly save that little bit more on fuel and um, certainly have more power compared to the previous ML which just had the 5 speed transmission. It's Tanzanite blue with light grey leather interior. The 500s were very well optioned. It's got memory, electric seats, drivers and passenger side. It's even got climate control, navigation and it is Bluetooth compatible. At the click of a button you can change the shock absorbers from sport to comfort and you can also raise the car by several inches. It's got the original two remote keys. It drives particularly well. The bodywork is in excellent condition. Uh, it does not have a tow bar which I think is a good thing in some cases because Sometimes it's got a tow bar, especially if it's got electric brakes. You don't know if it's been towing a three and a half ton boat around on the weekends, backing into the water, whatever it might be, or a very heavy, uh, heavy caravan. It has rear air conditioning controls. It's a five seater. It's very comfortable. I think they're incredible value for money. You know, it is very important and I know I keep mentioning it, the 5 litre engine on this car is very reliable. You might think, oh, I'd only need a 350, 3.5 litre V6 because a 5 litre is going to be more expensive to run. Well, if you look into it or if you speak to a mechanic, I think you'll find that the 350 is probably going to cost you more to run in terms of maintenance. The 350 is a good engine, don't get me wrong, but the 5 litre is a better engine. And uh, look, I won't go in into it too much beyond that. You can uh, certainly ask your mechanic what they think. Or if you have any specific questions you want to give us a call and ask, I'll be more than happy to answer any questions you might have. But yeah, the 5 litre is known as the 113 motor. And it ran alongside the 112 V6 engine. And uh, the ML350 basically got the updated engine. The wheels, the body, the interior is in very good condition. Uh, it does have a sunroof. The back seats are in very, very good condition as well, actually. Surprising for a car with light grey interior. It looks very good for its age. It's probably because they made this model up to around 2012. It does have the Harman Kardon sound system. And it does have pneumatic seats you've got the climate control as I said it's Bluetooth compatible hill descent control and uh, they drive very well the best thing about these MLs although they're an SUV they certainly drive more like a car the back seats fold down flat it's got parking sensors front and back and with a small turning circle it's quite easy to drive. Um, I have had quite a few cars myself because I generally change my cars every 12 months or so and I have had a 2005 5 litre ML500 much like this car and uh, I can tell you it was a particularly good car. It was fantastic on the freeway. The fuel consumption I didn't find was a problem. Whew, around the city, you should be able to get 15 or 16 litres per 100 kilometres. And on the freeway, it'll go right down to under 10. So if you're doing a lot of freeway driving, they're surprisingly economical.
And uh, you'll find a lot of these MLs are 320 CDI diesels and 350 petrols. And a lot of the 500s you do find will have two to 300,000 kilometres. So this has still got a long life ahead of it. And it's been serviced up to date. It could do with a, I think it could do with an oil change. But um, when you take the oil cap off and you look at the oil, it's actually very good. It's nice and clean. And uh, generally when we get these ML500s, they don't last very long. And especially when you see one like this in Tanzanite blue with such a nice light grey interior. It's not something I would think would last very long. Well, thank you for taking the time to watch this video. We are the Old Timer Centre. We're located only 15 to 20 minutes from Sydney Airport. You can hear the planes flying over. There's one flying over as we speak. We can help you with finance and we can even assist with interstate transport. We send cars every week to Victoria and Queensland and every month to, uh, to Perth. Thank you for taking the time to watch the video. We will speak to you very soon.